So, Metadyron DNA Beta is finally here and point blank online, we're privileged enough to get a copy here and we've been experimenting with it and here's some initial findings. This is a pretty amazing tool to be honest. Here is the track River Ocean Love and Happiness of Kia Pella. Have a listen. Now the mad thing here is, is that it's turned the whole tune into an audio piano roll. All of this information can be adjusted. If I select this chord, for example, let's bring it down. Have a listen. That's pretty heavy, the fact that it can do that. It's independent, you know, the pitch of India's vocal has not changed. The chord is moved down, but the vocal has not. That's a very, very powerful thing to be able to do. So we've got independent control of the notes of the chord, but the benefit for a lot of you guys is going to be the fact that you can export these chords, you know, musical elements from other people's tunes, and you can use them in your own productions. You can learn from their musical elements, you know, so you can change them a bit, give it your own spin. Let me take away the vocals here, and I'll show you what I mean. And by the way, you might want to listen to this. You'll find that it's not perfect in terms of taking the vocal out, but, you know, we can't expect this. It's not kind of, um, it's not that good. Um, it's an amazing tool, but I think to expect to be able to strip vocals right out and just hear the keys is a little bit too much. So have a listen what it sounds like without the vocal. Sounds like some kind of tortured animal, but don't worry about that. We've now got the chords clean so that we can use them. So I'll show you what we do. We go to File, go to Save As, drop down to MIDI File. So this is going to take all of the musical information and that includes everything else here. Let me zoom out. Everything, that includes the bass, the key sounds that are later on. The whole track has been transcribed, all of the musical elements. That's pretty staggering, to be honest, that it's been able to do that. So what I'll do is I'll go down into Logic and I'll import the MIDI file and we'll have a look, see how that's come out so you can get a feel for it. So, you know, there's lots of possibilities when you're using this tool. I'm just showing you one particular angle. So let's have here the MIDI file. Let's find it. There it is. Let's bring this through. And you can see here that the notes are in the piano roll. Let's just expand this a second. Let's have a listen to that. Pretty good, isn't it? Obviously, it needs to be quantized, but it's a great way to extract some musical information if you're not a musician and you want to learn from others. So for those of you asking the question, can we take the vocal out? Well, have a listen to this. I took out all of the musical information. So, you know, it's not perfect, but still usable for some people if you start that with a, a big delay around it, some reverb, put it in the mix, you know, it's going to sound good, you know. So there's tons of creative possibilities with this new Melodyne DNA Beta.